Hello everyone. I hope everyone who's watching here today is having a great day. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing another set of Halloween spooky scary set of nails. This time I'm using acrylic. Um, I'll be using this black and neon green by Blinko. I've already selected my sizes for the tips um, and I've applied my rubber base coat okay I've, I'm shaping them I want them to be the perfect length and as usual do the preparing of the of the nails by buffing them just giving them a little scruff down <laughs> so that the um, acrylic has somewhere rough to sit on um i went for these two colors because i haven't actually done too many acrylic and i haven't done a lot of black acrylic i've done black poly gel lately but not acrylic and for this set i was planning i'm like okay which color am i gonna go with first and i realized i must go with black because it will cause a lot less mess when I am uh, doing the final job because if I use it last I figured it might mess whatever is at the bottom if I'm if I maybe chose to go with the neon green as the the base you know the, the color at the bottom so I decided to go with the black first and finish off all the black um application acrylic application so that i make the monomer dirty once with just the black and then when i'm done with all the black i change the monomer i clean the brush and then i now apply the the neon green and what i wasn't aware of all that much or maybe i, I completely forgot about it is that this neon green is more jelly it's more it's trans transparent translucent so it's more jelly like so but it was a perfect color to use for this set because then it you it looked yellow on the top and as it ombres onto the black then it looks greenish it looks it has if you've seen the the thumbnail you know what i'm talking about if you're not too sure of what you saw carry on watching and you'll see when it actually blends into it so what I did is did um, I applied the black halfway for the middle and the ring finger so that I can ombre it and then the small the pinky um, is full black the whole nail is covered in full black and the index is the pointer finger is going to be covered in full neon green and then the thumb has the ombre of black and and, and and the neon green i tried to put some uh, glitter on there it, it didn't show too much it shows but it wasn't too much and i was i didn't plan it it just came up while i was doing the nail set so i just thought let me just carry on with it let me see and it made no difference actually okay so i won't be talking too much it's just a, an acrylic application and i'll come in later if i need to Oh yeah, and I'm also aware that I'm still using this crappy so-called Kalinsky brush and I know that I need to get a new one. So don't come for me about that because I'm aware of it. I need to buy a new one. I will buy one soon. Okay, carry on watching. I'll come in later.
Okay, now I'm shaping the nails, making sure that they are nice and crisp and straight before I can go in with the um, e-file. And after I go in with the e-file, I go back in again with the hand file to make everything smooth and flat and make sure that the, the surface of the nail is, is not too lumpy as much as possible yeah and i'm gonna go in on the thumb nail with the builder gel so i just want to take down the the little bulk of the green and then i'm gonna go in with the builder gel don't wonder why am i only doing the thumbnail uh, i only built the thumbnail it's to protect the, the the glitter that i've already applied on there okay that's it for now carry on watching okay the nail set is practically done the shaping everything everything is now done i'm just adding stickers stickers and i'm bombarding these nails with stickers just a whole lot of stickers that's all and some are glow in the dark some are just plain um, yeah that's it if you are still watching up to this far please let me know what you think about these nails I love them i enjoy them lately i'm enjoying the nails that i'm doing the nail sets that i'm doing even if well there are many people who also love the, the nails i do but even if um i don't get told that they are nice but the ones that i would feel i loved I, and i enjoy uh, making i actually do love them regardless of what the comments say anyway 
until we meet here again guys i hope you have yourselves great days further and you take care of yourselves and of each other let us end this video with a fun fact if you carve something on a tree it'll still be at the same height 50 years later okay everyone thank you very much goodbye take care subscribe